Hey there guys, it's Silva, your host, and we are back to finish Resident Evil 2. Let's um, begin by putting away that ink ribbon. And I reckon we're good on the ammo front. I mean, we're packing enough ammo to um, fight a small army, so that shouldn't be an issue. Got a herb for an emergency heal. Right, let's move, shall we? The way is clear to us. Now we need to head back the way we came at the end of the last part, past the door with the plants. <coughs> because, well, that is the correct way to go. <laughs> Nothing Nothing too complicated required there. It is the way to go. Another plan. Well, I suppose we're gonna have to, um... Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. That way. For some bizarre reason, I was remembering that plant bin at the other side, which made me inadvertently run into it. Not a smart move. Admittedly, not a smart move. Hold on. I'm thinking about something here. Wait there. Wait there. There's another door to go through with the umbrella keycard. And now that the power's restored, we should probably use it. And um, consider going back to the item box as well, because we're going to need a weapon box key. Lots of lovely grenade rounds I don't want to waste. There we go. Plants in here or zombies? plants. Oh god. The bad positioning. There's gonna be more than one in here. Yep, yep. Loitering on the corner. Like a loiterer. Come on, plant friend. We can't hit it yet. Sorry guys, dry throat. I might have to grab some water in a second. Okay, well at least the um, the flame rounds are getting some use. I mean, we're going to have to come back in here anyway. Later on, since it's the B scenario. So, I'll go and grab that weapon box key. Totally forgot about that. Should have picked it up at the beginning. That's on me, folks. That right there is on me. Right. Let's move. Now then. We need to go back in the way of the white corridor. The good thing is that colour coding allows you to easily differentiate what's what. White corridor has the item box. Blue corridor has the zero temperature room and the red one leads deeper into the complex. So, weapon box key. Grab some water, give me a second. Hydration is key. Hydration is key. <clears throat> like the other night, I um, did a Demon Souls, no sorry, Dark Souls 3 stream. And I didn't properly hydrate throughout. And I ended up waking up with a very, very sore throat in the morning after that stream. Which was not fun. <clears throat> it was not fun in the slightest. Hydration. Always remember your hydration, folks. Right. Now we're going in the way of the red corridor. Alright. Good. 
you hear a slight pop on the audio track now, I'm just muting my mic switch for one moment. I'll be right back. Alrighty, good. There we go. Yeah, this um, this Empower headset that I'm using has a built-in audio switch on it. So just flick the switch, and you um can mute the volume. Makes life way easier. Combine these herbs, mix them. And we'll save this other green for a red herb that will be awaiting us a bit further down the line. Down the ladder we go. Right. Now we might swap to grenade rounds. Gonna make our life a bit easier. No more plants around for a little while. I will admit that dealing with the um, the plants is Claire is way easier than with Leon. That made me jump. Ow! One moment. Ow! 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 ow. That made me jump. I flinched so hard that I hurt the repetitive strain injury in my right arm. Oof. Yeah, that stung. That really stung. Okay, no. For that, you're getting acid rounds. You're getting special treatment. We are almost out of acid rounds, though. We better watch it. Back to grenade. There's another one still. How many of them are in here? Right. Carefully grab a green. Grab a green. Just to heal some of that excess damage. We got a few spares. That's not a problem. Come on. There we go. Need to get that damage. Excellent. Very nice. Now we'll head this way. <coughs> Carry on through. Nothing to really stop here for all things considered aside a map. And in here. <coughs> Ah yes, insect room. It's coming. Which I imagine is going to be <clears throat> very, very fun. This should be our last use on the key card. Yep, discard. We do have flame rounds equipped, I think, so the moth should be a bit easier. Nope, I had grenade rounds equipped. How the hell did I forget that? I only did it 10 seconds ago. Yeah, the moth's in here. Auto-aim is tracking it. Oh god. Bad moth. Very bad moth. Right. Okay. Grenade time. Three in one. Yeah, register the handprint. So I believe that's guest. G U E S T. <coughs> Marvelous. Registration complete, valid for 24 hours. I can't remember if I registered Leon's in the A scenario. I'll definitely register Claire's when we get around to doing her A scenario. Avoid the maggoty things. 
red herb here. <coughs> oh, God. Sorry, I'm, um... Ah, sorry, I keep kind of coughing a little bit and uh, clearing my throat. I have a really scratchy throat right now. There seems to be no middle ground. I either have an excessively dry throat, or it alternates very quickly between being excessively dry and feeling clogged and needing decongestant, which is kind of dreadful. I don't know what causes it. Even the doctor doesn't know what causes it. It's the strangest thing. Are there zombies in here? I assume that- yeah, I hear them. Hey, friend. That guy was hard as nails. Lots of them in here. Alright. There we go. Master room key. That's pretty much all we need. The B scenario is super quick. You come in here, get a key, and that's it. Oh, he's gonna get up. Yeah, I can tell by the way he fell. Alright. We might save some rounds here. No need to kill all of them excessively. Just waste ammo that we, um... Could do to save, all things considered. Yeah. Good. Right, let's move it. <coughs> Annette should be here now, I think. Or nearby at the very le Oh, no, wait, that's A scenario. Right. Yeah, miscalculated that one. That's A scenario. Right. Here we go. Anything else we could pick up and use to save ammunition? You know what, we might as well get the spark shot out at this point. And grab a full heal. I mean, Lord knows we, um... There she is. Okay. Annette! Where's Sherry? I asked her, and she's never even heard of the G-Virus before. Which room? Tell me. Sherry! No! Annette! The samples inside the pendant Sherry's wearing. How would Mr. X know that it's in there, unless he had some kind of bioorganic tracking? Well, no, some kind of bioorganic incorrect term, some kind of bioorganic weapon tracking system built in. Does he? Damn liquors! I am deeply unimpressed. That's twice I've flinched very hard. Ow! Freaking repetitive strain injuries, loving this. Ooh. Stinging. Stinging a bit. Oh god, I think I need to take my muscle relaxers. Ouch. Okay. Right, so we need to double, double back to the, um... Room with the master key, or the power room key. <clears throat> Sparky. I dubbed the Sparky. I really should use it and save some rounds. Alright, apparently there's nothing in here. But, can we get in? Oh no, wait, wrong corridor. Right. We need to get back in to the, um...
room that's got the two biometric handprint locks on it. Which is blue. We'll check blue corridor. Here we go. Let's have a looky. Did I register Leon's handprint? <clears throat> okay, that didn't work. Yeah. We didn't register it as Leon. Fair enough. Alright. I'll be sure to do that when we do the next set of A and B scenarios. Alright. Back this way then. And I imagine there'll be some zombies or something in here to deter us considering we need to go this way. No. Oh, pleasant surprise. Down we go then, I guess. Down we go. <clears throat> right. Master key is required. We don't have that yet. Open sesame. Right. We'd better go and deal with Mr. X. Right. I believe we pushed that box into place already. Down we go. Well, yeah, considering I recorded this yesterday. All the... Or recorded the previous part yesterday, should I say? I definitely remember putting that box into position. Right. Discard. Now we're gonna have to help Sherry deal with them. Um, Mr. Tyrant. Here we go. Sherry! Help me, Claire! The monster's after your pendant! Throw it to me! Good girl. Now run, Sherry! What you want. Come on! Here! This is what you're looking for, right? Fine. Then go get it! Sucker! The self destruct sequence has been activated. Repeat. The self-destruct sequence has been activated. This sequence may not be aborted. All employees proceed to the emergency car at the bottom platform. That was excellent. I love it how sassy Claire was in that segment. Basically baiting him and winding him up. Right, gonna be a slight pause in the recording for editing reasons. Give me one moment. And we are back. Let's do this. Pretty much get to go finish the game now. Not too much left. Oh dear. Well, that's um certainly a hand. Where are you? Sherry! Where is she? Right. We'd better go. Hold on. 
we don't have the master key on us. Is it in here? Hmm. Right. It's not in here, is it? Like, we didn't leave it in here, did we? Not in there. Which means it can only be in one other place. Like I said, my memory gets a bit jumbled up with the B scenarios, so. Up we go. Activate the lift. Up, up, up. Oh, wait, it's through here. I know what happens now, I remember. Here we go. Now we just need to... We don't have the master key yet. Which means we need to go this way. It's around here somewhere. Wow, do I really have no memory of where this thing is? Hmm. Did we really not pick it up? Wow, um, okay. Yeah, patchy memory for the B scenario is very patchy. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna have to figure this out. I don't remember where the master key is. Or what event trigger gives you it. Not in here either, that was silly, but it was worth a try. Okay. Let's do this. I'm trying to think of where it would be. You don't get an MO disc in here. There we go. <laughs> Mom! <laughs> Mom! Jerry, you have to escape. I know I've been a terrible mother, but I still love you. Forgive me. <laughs> Okay, now I remember the event trigger. Yeah, the... I'm especially vague on Claire's B scenario. Leon's not so much. I've um, done that a fair few times, but... Claire's B scenario? Not as much as I'd like to admit. Alright, we've got the master key. Now we've got to get Sherry to come with us. Okay. Come on, Sherry. Safety awaits us. Gotta kind of slow myself down a bit here because if she um gets too far away she just pauses. 
Right. Here we go. Down we go. Use the master key. And because it's Claire's B scenario, Sherry doesn't get infected with the Jeep um, larvae. So, you don't have to make the devil vaccine, so that actually saves a lot of time. That's not the cannon route, though. So. It doesn't really count. Because that was confirmed both in dialogue from developers and in Resident Evil 6 when Sherry was found to be infected with the G virus because of a certain scene. Time to board the train. Yeah, I'm gonna have to play Claire's B scenario a bit more so I become a bit more familiar with it. I'll go and get this thing moving. Right. Okay. Okay. Let's move it. Have I got enough space for the plugs? Yeah, I do. Oh wait, there's a key you need first. See what I mean? Vague memory is vague. Let's do this. We're getting there. Slowly but surely. In here? I know it's on the train somewhere. Also gives the chance to re-equip. Yeah, there's the key we need. We might unequip the spark shot because it takes up a lot of space. And get a fourth heal. Actually, no. no, 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 no. Get rid of the acid rounds. Very nice. And then get the fourth heal. Well, fourth heal out of our box. We have five in total now. Don't forget the key, Silver. Platform key. That's what we need. And proceeding to the bottom platform, would you calm down, game? Like, I genuinely like you to calm down. We are proceeding. Now, we um, have 26 grenade shells and 11 flame. If that's not enough. I don't know what is. All right, Sherry. Okay. Brisk nod, from Sherry. Can we go in here? And does it have any items? Right. Not yet. For some reason I had a vague memory of grenade shells being in there, but that was also incorrect. Quite incorrect. Here we go. Open it up. That squeaky gate. Five minutes until detonation. Five minutes until detonation. We better not screw around here. Is there anything down here worthwhile? Nah, just another item box. Go. 20 seconds wasted that we shouldn't be wasting. Right, let's just go. Right, got enough space for the plugs. Grab those. Grab said plugs. Joint plugs. 
go. Don't get stuck on the scenery, Silver. Gotta love tank controls. That's where we need to be. Put the plugs in. We better hurry up. The entire facility is shaking. Right. Put them in. And it's time for happy fun time with Mr. X. Showtime. That's heavy damage already. Very heavy damage, okay. Move, don't get back to a wall, you idiot. Here. Use this. Like, Who what? Are you? Why does Ada randomly lob that down here on Claire's B scenario? I don't get that. Right, where's the launcher? No, 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 Mr. X, don't be a dick. Okay. You lose, big guy. Like, it inadvertently confirms that it has survived in the A scenario, but at the same time it makes no logical sense for her to help Claire. Why does she chuck that grenade launcher, or grenade launcher, rocket launcher down and be like, yo, here's a rocket launcher, it's dangerous to go alone, take this. Yes, I know I made a Zelda reference, not a big Zelda fan, but still, it's um, it's been memed so many times that you might as well just go along with it. Here we go. One last boss fight left, and we'd better pick up those acid shells while we are here. One second. There they are. Gonna need those. The biggest danger of the run is out the way now with Mr. X dead. There's pretty much no threats left. Well, save one, but um... He's very much an everything or nothing threat. Can we go in this way? Yeah, we can. They don't waste ammo fighting those guys. Literally no need. Gotta just flick on the power. And there we go. Oh no, wait, we do have to go that way. The tunnel gate isn't open yet. Better hurry. Stop wasting freaking time. We still have enough. Not a massive amount of um, shells, but enough. We certainly did blast our way through the entire stockpile by the end of this run, didn't we? I mean, we've literally used nothing else. What do you expect? Okay, gates open. Let's get out of here before the whole facility goes kaboom, shall we? Right, let's get it open and get moving. Open sesame.
okay? Yes, I'm fine. It's over. No. I have to find my brother. You're right. This is just the beginning. has protected you. It will always be with you. Claire. Sherry. We're not out of the woods yet. What was that? I'd better go and check that out. Right. Swap back to uh, flame rounds. It's going to be a very much a have at the situation. Biohazard is outbreak imminent. The emergency system has been activated. This train will detonate. Repeat, this train will detonate. Oh, God, really? Splody trains? I don't need a splody no! train. What's wrong with this thing? I don't know. The door won't open. We don't need splody trains. That's the last thing we need. Here we go. The big bad. You've had some better days, bro. Much better days. Phase four. Right, better move it. Can he use that rocket launcher shot for one? Okay. What am I doing trying to combine that? I thought to myself the game gave us the rocket launcher we'd might as well use it don't let all that Birkin juice touch your feet Claire gross right now we are safe and sound at the finishing line yep Are you okay? 
you sure? I'm okay. Where's Leon? Leon? Leon! Right here. Leon! You're both safe. Just die. We've got to get out of here. Move it! Go! was a close one. That was pretty impressive back there, Sherry. It was nothing. I saw someone do that on TV once. Come on. We've got to move out. Now what's the problem? Is something following us? Hey, we still have a job to do. Let's go. Go? Oh, you can't mean. Chris, I have to find you. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have finished Resident Evil 2. Now, this has been a fun experience, hasn't it? Got that lovely B scenario ending. That guitar. The tried and tested the tried and tested sound of a game made in the 90s. Now, depending on the recording time, so I want to keep this under an hour. We might skip to the end of the credits. In which case I will be bidding you a farewell there. If not, just um, stick with me for a bit longer and let's enjoy that musical goodness. Well, um, YouTube's copyright cyborgs permitting. <laughs> we can only hope. But yeah, job done. <clears throat> Today's been a very, very productive recording day for me. I've managed to get three um, videos for the channel recorded all in one day, and I'm going to be streaming tonight as well. So, it's going to be a very, very busy night channel-wise. Three videos recorded, plus editing and rendering to be done, and then I'm streaming. It's literally a channel day today. So, that's going to be fun. Yeah. Very fitting ending to one of the best games of all time, in my opinion. Listen to that guitar, guys. I love talking through credits at the end of a game. Shinji Mikami. Hey, Mikami-san. Very nice. KG Inafune, another very, very prominent Capcom name. Directed by Hideki Kamiya, another very, very prominent Capcom name. The, le the legend, the living legend who bans everybody who approaches him on Twitter. It's almost a rite of passage to be banned by Hideki Kamiya. Alright, we're done. Let's check out our atrocious time, shall we? It won't be good. It ain't gonna be a speedrun time for certain. Not by a long shot. Let's check it out, shall we? Moment of truth. We got a B. 3 hours 41, 4 saves. Eh, yeah, not bad. Not too bad for a casual playthrough. So yeah, I do reckon that this is where we are gonna leave it. Thank you very much for stopping in, and your continued support, as always, is very, very much appreciated. We're going to check out these in-game rewards here, because you do get a few nice in-game rewards for finishing. Battle mode and for survivor coming our way now. We might have to try those for the channel. We'll, um, save over that. <clears throat> Back to a Leon A save. Very good. You can now play another scenario. Uh, you can now play another scenario if you make new save data. Oh, I shall. Don't you worry about that. I definitely shall. Right. New save data incoming. 
And I believe we have unlocked fourth survivor now. Put it at the bottom. Oh, it's on a range. Yeah, there's EX Battle. There's... Oh, no, there's Brad. We know about Brad. Stars member Brad became a living dead. He's roaming around somewhere in the police station possessing a special key. Find him and help him rest in peace. Reach the police station without getting any items. That's not too difficult, actually. Right. And that applies to both A and B scenario. If you do it in the... Well, if you do it in the A scenario, he'll be wandering around in the B scenario. Provided you haven't killed him already. Actually, no, he's appearing whatever. Alright. I do believe that this is where we are going to leave it. Like I said, the continued support has been awesome. And I will see you in the next one. Leave a like or comment if you want to see the other set of A and B scenarios from Claire and then Leon's perspective. And yeah. Thank you very much. I'll see you in the next one. So guys, I have been Silver your host. Have a fantastic morning, afternoon, or night, and I will see you again very soon. Take care, guys.